Hello and welcome. Next I like to show you that and learn you you new thing that what is compression the compression test in in car engine. What is, what does that mean? What is compression? Compression test. What is that? What compression test means? This compression test purpose is that we test engine pressure. Engine pressure. Engine max. Maximal pressure. An idea is almost same when we have like tire and this feel where we have this car's tire and their inside is this air. In air is their inside air and this is like feel feel and and tire like in like Michelin or Goodyear Michelin Brickstone Brickstone tire is that one and there is inside this compressed air in that area like two bars this is the feels idea and then when we have engine in there and there we have those pistons normally we have four pistons these are cylinder tubes and then in some area in here when we have compression turn there is pressure in their inside in that area these are like pistons piston are in here and this is engine block engine block and we measure that inside areas pressure like in this fields area they are almost similar there is line arrow and, and then when we measure that pressure in here there is normally when in this inside is field there is 20 in here we have amount what is like 10 bar pressure in inside this this uh, piston array and this bar what is in in here this is this compressor compression 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 pressure okay and then how we can measure this engine inside areas pressure there is normal spark plug hole in there small spark plug in there and for that spark plug next I will show that what spark plug look like and here is this spark plug what place is in that small line in that area in here is that spark plug and it goes like in one hole and there is like if I zoom that area in here a little bit in here there is hole that kind of hole where the spark plugs I rotate that in here and then when the spark plug is in that area what is in there in that same area I insert now this my compression compression test tool and here I have this my compression tool and it's like a specific measurement thing and there are different kinds of these hoses what this thread is similar than in that one thread and then I am planning to rotate 
that my measurement tool in that hole where is this spark plug hole and this is the key ID and then when I rotate that in here first then same way as the spark plug in here next step is that I need to insert in here this matrix and this uh, this pressure metric and it it starts to show that when I press that in here there are those lights and there's bar metrics the same way as in wheels and tires and this this connection happens so that I insert that array my my matrix in in this my hose and then when I have inserted that that my hose in well in this spark plug hole then I need to only start a little bit this is my engine and here is my key and I only start a little bit start motor and then pistons moves in here and they generate the pressure and let's go to do that next in this real engine area okay and here I have this real engine and in that holes and here we have the spark plugs and next I take this plastic cover what is ignition coil I take that away and here is my tool my socket and friends and I take this first first part okay in here that we can see this this spark plug now this coil is away and then I need special special spark plug this socket it looks like in that and there was this old spark plug and then I inserted my tool in here normally these holes are quite deep because we have those newer engines and then then I open this spark plug and I rotate that and here I have this spark plug what is in here and, and in now this hole is in there free and for that area I insert that my compression test hose and here is this my hose and it happens so that I insert that in here hold carefully and then I only rotate that little bit and so long then this take contact in that way now it's in there and then I insert my mat matrix in there there was this my matrix and first I need to insert that that there is this bar bar setting in there and and okay bar is in there okay good and then I inserted my my system in there with movement and now we heard this click and then then this meter is waiting motor starting, pressure is zero, zero in there and then I go to inside start this engine a little bit and when I start that car like five seconds then there is amounts actually two seconds is enough Ok, 
see and now there is this amount what there is that that there is I take this system away and this my matrix told to me that that there is there was there is memory that there was nine point thirty three was this result and then I do that again because there is I need to this is like first cylinder I select first cylinder and I I think that now it's it has been resetted and then I insert that again in there and my matrix back okay it is there and let's look the what is now this amount when I go to start engine again okay now there is bigger amount there looks to be like 10 10 is this matrix and I take my tool away then we look this result and and there is result that maximum pressure was 10.7 okay 10.7 okay and then I do that same measurement for those other cylinders and we check those results next okay and now I have this my compression test result in this my me meters memory and I can check there is cylinder number in this right upper area and when I press that that button it automatically changes cylinder numbers and then we go to number one what was the first one and there was pressure 10.70 and I have here special document paper where we insert in that area this amount that there is 10 is normal in that that scale that if we have 10 pressure it is normal and I insert in here line in that like cross that this amount was almost in there 10.70 this is like diagram and then next cylinder was a little bit higher 11.95 and there's cylinder 2 and it is almost in here that amount 11.95 and then next cylinder is now cylinder 3 and there was 13.25 and it's like in here it is really high amount I do in here those cross that I can write diagram and then this final cylinder 4 was 13 point it is also in here 13.85 okay and then I can do this my next job that I can do this diagram and this diagram shows that that this because this 10 is like normal engine an excellent engine is like in this 12 it, it shows that my engine is in really excellent situation that all cylinders works well especially this cylinder one little bit a little bit less but it's still fine because in if we have so small pressures like like six in here 
it means that then this this engine is scrap. And if if there there might be situation that 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 I do this measurement for some cars engine and then we could get those amounts like six and five and seven and then six point five in in here. Then then we can write this diagram and notice that now in in that engine what is different cars engine this engine is really bad situation it's like almost scrap and there are those many issues that the pistons are too worn out those intake valve and exhaust valve there might be leaks and then also cylinder head gasket there is leak and that's this air goes away like in here is this my picture there is so many this is like in cylinder area there are those valves in here and in here and there are leaks and air goes out there is those valve intake and exhaust and what this pressure goes out and also in here and this piston, what is in here, there is leaks, air goes then in that area out. And then this pressure is in here low, inside in this cylinder tube. Okay, and then when we measure spore engines, pressure, it can be like a 3 bar. And if compression rate is like 3 bar, it is too low. And why this three bar is too low? Because then we have difficulties to to generate this spark and this enough pressure that the gasoline start to expand and 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 fire and generate this gasoline to fire in inside this area. That's we need high pressure. What is this ten bars or more? Okay, and this was information that how to measure those cylinder cylinder compression test and the idea is almost same like in to measure wheels pressure and in that matter what I have in here this could be used also for this field pressures and tires measurement. But this is now specialized for this cylinder pistons compression test. And then how much these testers cost? The most cheapest tester cost only 20 US dollars or 20 euros. And this little bit better whereas the digital measurement and memory. This cost like 50 to 100 US dollars per this set. And this Whole, whole package. Okay, and thank you for watching this video and have a nice day to you.